Hello and welcome back everyone, my name is Seth and today we're going to be working on part 15 of how to make a Discord bot. Check it. In this episode we're going to be working on making our very own leaderboards, so that means that users will be able to see how they rank against their friends and who can collect the most currency. Before we get started, I need to let you guys know that this only works with a database, so go back and watch my databases video. If you did not, it will not work with JSON files. Also, I wanted to thank each and every one of you for liking my videos and subscribing to my channel. It means a lot to me. We're almost at 200 subscribers, so keep it up, guys. I really appreciate it. Now, onto the video. We can go ahead and create our leaderboard command by right-clicking commands, new file, and leaderboard.js. In here, we're going to go ahead and start by adding a few packages. We're going to add the Discord package. And we're going to go ahead and add Mongoose so we can grab our database information. As well as our bot config. Next up, let's go ahead and add our connection to our database. So we're going to go do mongoose.connect and we're going to grab our bot config dot mongo pass comma curly brackets enter down user or use new URL parser set that to true as well as use unified topology true okay we can go ahead and end that off and then go down and we're going to add our model so we're going to grab const data equals require and we're going to grab models data dot dot js okay so now that we've got our database information we can go down and make our module dot exports dot run equals async and bot message args and then we can arrow function curly brackets so we're going to go ahead and add our module dot exports dot help real quick and that's going to be equals name and here we go comma aliases array and that's it for that and then we're going to go ahead and name this leaderboard as well as we can give it a few shortcuts we're going to do lb for leaderboard and top for uh, top players or whatever so that's all we got to do for that now we can get straight into the main code for this file so next we're going to go ahead and grab our data we're going to do data dot find one and curly brackets in here we're going to check for a leaderboard and search for a leaderboard called all down we're going to go down and do dot sort and we're going to sort this by here enter down oh enter down and then in here we're going to do um money and descending descending okay now we can go ahead and go here and do dot execute and double parentheses error res arrow function curly brackets enter down okay sweet and we have an error, we need to do a comma here. Okay, next we're gonna go ahead and just start our code. So if error, we're gonna go console dot console.log error. And next we're gonna check for uh, actually we're gonna set our variable page equals math dot ceiling res dot length whoops res dot length 
divided by 10. Okay, so that's what we're going to set our page to. And we're going to go ahead and create an embed real quick. So we're going to do let embed equal new discord dot message embed. And now we're going to do uh, embed dot set title. And we're going to set that to leaderboard. Next, we're going to go ahead and do embed dot set thumbnail. And we're going to set this to an image. I already have an image picked out, but you can basically go find one on the internet, post the link or paste the link in here. Okay. Next, now we can go ahead and define PG. Uh, this is essentially another variable page, but uh, there's a difference. Um, so we're going to let it equal to parse integer args zero. And now we need to check if pg does not equal math dot floor pg then we need to set pg equal to one if um, if pg does not exist we also need to set pg equal to one and now we're going to define end and that's going to be equal to pg times 10 and then we're going to define start and that's going to equal uh, in parentheses uh, pg times 10 minus 10. Now we can go ahead and create our if statements. We're going to do if res.length equals 0. We can grab this and we're going to set embed.add field. And we're going to make that say error as well as the next field is going to say no pages found. Okay, that's it for that one. Now we can go ahead and check else if res.length is less than or equal to start, then we can go ahead and um, do embed.add field and we're going to do error and then the second field is going to be pages no page not found sweet I'm just gonna go ahead and space these out so it looks a little nicer makes it easier to read and now we can check for else if uh, res dot length is less than or equal to end and in here we're going to go ahead and do embed dot set footer and we're going to grab uh, we're going to do page and we're going to grab a variable pg so page blank of page okay like that and then below that we're going to do a for loop and we're going to do i equals start and we're going to do i is less than or equal to res.length and we're going to do i plus plus okay we're going to go ahead and do curly brackets embed dot add field now in here we're going to go ahead and do um i plus one and a dot here with another and we're going to do res i oops go back in here dot name and we're going to end that one off and do our second one so we're going to do money twice so we have a dollar sign and we're going to do res i dot money dot two to local string like that and we can go ahead and end that off then and then we're done with this one, so we can go on to the next one and do else. And we're going to do embed dot set footer. And we're going to set that to the same thing as up here. So I'm going to go ahead and copy and paste it. And we can do another for loop. I equals start. I is less than end. Uh, I plus plus 
and we can do curly brackets, and then we're going to do embed dot add field, and we're going to do essentially the same thing as up here. So we're going to go ahead and just copy this, paste, and now all we have left is to send a message. So we're going to do message dot channel dot send. And we're going to do embed. So we're going to send our embed. And that should be everything. We should be done now. So let's go ahead and run our bot. Do node dot. We can go ahead and try top. And we actually have an error. So we have an error name of undefined. Okay, sorry about that guys, but I found the error. We're gonna go ahead and just change this find one to just find because we're finding multiple pieces of data, not just one. Uh, I overlooked that, I apologize. So we're gonna go ahead and open up our terminal now, do node dot, our bot should run. And then if we head on over to Discord, we can go ahead and do top. And it should show leaderboard, a little cool icon here. It'll show number one, the user who's in first place, their money, and then from so on and so on. And then if we go ahead and do top two, that'll show us page two of the leaderboard. However, because there isn't enough users to have a page two, it's gonna say error, page not found. So um, that's pretty much it for this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, make sure you smash that thumbs up button down below. And uh, I'm almost 200 subscribers, so if you could subscribe, I'd really appreciate it. And uh, thanks for watching, guys.